Starting today, workers will begin construction on the high-level bridge. Ashley Moser's live from the Toledo Landmark with more on how this project may affect your morning commute. Good morning, Ashley. Annette, the bridge behind me has undergone extensive rehabilitation, but this most recent project will add work platforms and also safety devices, making it safer for drivers to continue using this Toledo landmark. Starting today, preliminary lane closures will are expected to last for 10 weeks. So ODOT says single lane restrictions will be in effect as work is done to install these safety platforms. This thoroughfare was built in 1929, between 1929 and 1931, and cost around $3 million. Since then, there have been two construction projects and between 1960 and 1970 and also 1996 to 97. The latest project resurfaced the span's concrete, replaced cables, and even involved painting on another coat of that iconic bright blue paint. Well, the deck replacement from this project is expected to last 50 years. So net these lane restrictions will last through December and in the spring of 2014, the bridge will actually be closed for 19 months and drivers may want to avoid this bridge uh, during rush hour and right up the river. Maybe use Martin Luther King Jr. Bridge to get around that live from downtown Toledo. This is Ashley Moser for WNWO today. Back to you.